Damn dog. Come here. Can't tell if he's an enemy dog or just a dog. But he's ours now. He's acting like he was an enemy dog. 300 to recover him. Run like hell. So go kill somebody, dog. That'd be really awesome of you. Shit. What, really? Seriously! Get him. Go kill somebody. Somebody else. Hey, don't shoot my dog, you bitch. Oh, you. Go to sleep. Who the hell is hitting me? Well, you. Cut it out. Hey, buddy. Ah, don't worry about it. Get out of here, you old bastard. We'll fix it. Now, rescue the other target. Working on it. To get these guys out of the picture first. They're annoying. They shot at me. Subject on board. Leave the rest to us. Not nice to shoot at Wolfie. Uh -oh. He gets mad when you shoot at him. Yeah, I'll get right on that. I got shit to do for He's coming too. Roger that. They're all coming. Everything flows. Alright, any other jerk holes need to go to sleep? You gotta extract him. Alright, dog. Let's go get this guy. Oh good, we know right where he is. Marker placed. Okay, let's go. Let's try to get a resupply while we can. I don't speak your language, quit battling at me. 
Uh huh. Your radio's busted. You suck. <laughs> Can't imagine who did that. Better look out, dog. That's gonna hit you. Oh well, you'll learn. Oh. I guess it didn't hit him. <laughs> Hello. Let's see. Let us shoot you right in the hip. That'll do. Whop. Oh, not the face. Not the face. Whop. What? Something happened? My buddy is shot. Boss, we've picked up some movement. The squad is on its way to Gazeba camp. We've ID'd them as some CFA heavyweights. These aren't your everyday reinforcements. God damn it. Whatever's about to happen, you need to get the target out now. Working on it, you whore. There, whatever. Knock them both out again. Oh shit. It's got good visibility and not many places to hide. Use the landscape wherever possible. Yeah, I kind of noticed. Enemy All right. presence detected. The map has been updated. Why don't you stand up a little bit? Just a little. Damn it. Enemy clear. Detected. The map has been updated. There we go. Got him. Blah 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 blah. Getting our asses kicked. We suck. Damn. Subject on board. Take the rest to us. Hostile, call this. <laughs> gotcha. Extract him. <laughs> Down he goes. And he'll be asleep in a moment, too. Such lazy soldiers. Car is probably coming for us. You have arrived at your destination. Where's our boy? God damn it, would you hit him? Oh, I see him. So we got to get an extraction down here. So kill somebody, please. That'll do. Thank you. Who else we got? Helicopter out. Support helicopter. Get over here! Hey, buddy! That's him. That's the target. He's injured. Looks half starved, too. Yeah, I will so fix that. Can stand the shock of a Fulton extraction. Get him out by chopper. Get to the chopper! Yeah, yeah. Jeez. Oh god, that means a zombie apocalypse. Make it quick, buddy. Get up there! Whoa! 
<laughs> Later, bitches. Have fun with those hangovers. Yeah, we might want to depart faster. They're getting some hits in. <laughs> Flawless work. You never cease to amaze, boss. Wow. Extraction arrived at mother base. Ooh, heroism plus 180. Nice. Mission complete. Great work. I'll take it. We came out of the green. Yay! Well, that was fun. Kojima! What do we get? Okay, okay, another tape. Complete. Lots of Kikongo, that makes me sad. <clears throat> Look at all these elites, good god. Pretty good. Oh, 31% done. One of the job offers we received concerns me. Mission There's a PF commander who's been talking big about getting into the nuclear arms trade. This could be connected to that yellow cake. You think? And there's another contract I'd like you to handle. You look so it's tired. Job, but we need to divert Cypher's attention. Check the mission list for the details. <laughs> Poor Snake, he looks like he's ready to pass out. analyzing that yellow cake cipher was moving there was nothing unusual about the composition of the yellow cake itself most of it was oxidized uranium with the rest being impurities various metals as well as traces of organic matter what's interesting is the composition of these impurities when we checked them against the impurities found in the copper ore it was clear the yellow cake didn't come from shinkalogwe meaning they went to the trouble of mining two sources of uranium, then transported them together in different states. Nice. Another thing. We detected a very thin layer of highly enriched uranium in the middle of the yellow cake. Oh, joy. Now that is very interesting. It may not be a lot, but it points to the existence of uranium enriching technology. After all, yellow cake can't naturally produce highly enriched uranium. If they could mass produce this, They'd be just one step away from a gun barrel type nuclear bomb. Ugh. But uranium enrichment requires advanced technology and a large scale facility. If that kind of place existed in Zaire, the Soviet Union wouldn't sit idly by. And there's another question Where were they transporting the yellow cake and malachite uranium? The first place that comes to mind is South Africa. Oh, you know, they were setting the up a party. was supposed to have abandoned nuclear weapons development after caving to international pressure. But rumors persist that it's continued in secret. Plus, ZRS were escorting the truck, and they're based out of South Africa. And then South Africa does have an abandoned test site. If Cypher's involved with nuclear development in South Africa, but how would that fit with their weapon to surpass Metal Gear? I bet Metal Gear couldn't survive a nuke. Shinkalobwe. There's a name I haven't heard in a while. The U.S. bought a lot of uranium from Shinkalobwe mine during World War II for the Manhattan Project. They even sent a squad from the Army Corps of Engineers to reopen the mine after it was flooded. That's how good its uranium must have been. With that, the world's first nuclear test was a success. Shinkalobwe uranium might have been used enough Hiroshima and Nagasaki bombs, too. Just hearing its name is like seeing all the phantoms of the war rise up to haunt us. But all the uranium's dried up, and the mine's been closed for years. So someone reopened it. Right. Zero risk security hey, seized control of the area, and we're forcing locals to work in it. And the Zaire and oh, yeah, I used to run one. What they took in exchange for looking the other way. Um, Mabutu I should run that again. His That's taste good point. Somehow, he'll gladly sell the rights to some old mine. The question is, 
Why would Zero Risk Security do this kind of thing? Or rather, why were their employers, Cypher, interested in an abandoned mine? They'd be getting trace amounts of uranium, and to the naked eye, it appears to be ordinary malachite, meaning security would be lax. Not a very efficient way of obtaining it, but easier to move. But how would they enrich it at its destination? <laughs> Magic. Does the yellow cake really have a layer of highly enriched uranium in it? Having trouble believing it? No. If they say it's real, then it's real. In which case, they might have some enrichment method that we don't know about. And this was to test it out. It's possible. And that would mean it's almost complete. <laughs> Rot roll. Rogue Coyote operates mainly out of Africa these days. Of the three PFs, they're the smallest. However, they scooped up most of the Rhodesian SAS after the country collapsed four years ago. Picture their entire organization as one big special forces unit. With Rhodesia a British colony, the Rhodesian SAS had its origins in 22 SAS squadron. <coughs> they started out short, with less than 200 Southern Rhodesia volunteers, but in '51 they were incorporated into 22 SAS as members of the British Commonwealth and deployed to fight guerrillas in the Malayan emergency. Even now. 22 SAS keeps the C Squadron designation empty in recognition of their service. Aww. In a way, you could say the SAS almost makes up the core of Rogue Coyote. Later on, they were bolstered by other talent, including former Sela Scouts and 32 Battalion. These guys are direct descendants of the best special forces in the world. They won't go down without a fight. Don't get careless. Kunganga Mine. Civil war has been going on in that region for the Not last bad. 20 years. It's being fought by what are now two ethnic groups, the Buta and the Mbele. Originally, you could barely tell them apart, but the reason for the current armed conflict goes back to World War I. After the war, their land was colonized mm. by a European power, and it decided to give local control to the Buta. That split the two groups into rulers and subjects, laying the foundations for an inevitable civil war. The friction between them remained even after they won independence from Europe. God, that's a monster. The Buta are holding on to power to this day, and the Mbele rebels continue to fight back. The conflict is funded by locally mined gold, rare metals, diamonds. They've used the money from those to arm themselves, buy oil, and even hire PFs. The Buta administration owns the mining rights to Kungenga Mine. But most of the laborers are Mbele, who they've taken prisoner. <coughs> product they've gouged out of their land is bought up by cheap western corporations and this civil war is fueled by the profits that's how it goes one country's people is split apart by another country then the two groups tear up their own land for money in order to fight each other now this civil war started by a foreign power is the norm and it's sucking up all the country's resources pfs are just the same they follow the money taking war with them wherever they go that goes for us too <laughs> it's an endless river of bloody retaliation and we are standing downstream should we make a stand and staunch the flow or wade in amongst the corpses and make a bigger splash than the rest bigger splash we'll follow your lead boss kill them all we can eventually squish everybody I don't know why I just developed all these sniper right but you know Done now. Woo. Very nice. What about rocket launchers? We need some advancements in rocket propulsion technology. This beast. And then this one, because it looks cool. Development project has been added. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> you have to have a medical team ranked up to build that rocket launcher? That's how badass it is. Hey, Dryan, how's it going? And yeah, no kidding. Totally an RPG. Or, sorry. I different version of RPG. I thought you meant role-playing game. 
This is a bit RGPified, but you know. There's nothing wrong with rocket launchers in a stealth game. It's a different flavor of stealth. And, you know, you, you stealthily position yourself to violently deploy the loud explosive Clouds thing. Approaching. All fun and game. <laughs> you know, I have not touched the shotguns. Can we do anything for... What's her nuts? Yes, we can. Beef up her sniper rifle. Now she can wear her naked bloody thing. Excellent. What else got added? Oh, that stuff. <laughs> oh, we just need one more bond level with her. Ah, we'll get there. Uh, is there any combat mission that'll get us some fuel? We just need 200 Please units of fuel. Oh, look at that. Go get it! Unit dispatched. Get some fuel! Fucking bastards! We even got the mission for it and you frickin' failed, you asshats! I am supremely disappointed! Please specify a project. You dishonor me! Not allowed back on the platform, go to hell! <laughs> Oh, hey, we can beef up this rocket launcher. Wait a minute. We need this one? It's a rocket launcher, of course we need it. Development project has been added. And let us upgrade him, too. Now I have a wide variety of choices for my uh, rocket launching needs. How about the walker? Please specify a project. Nope, nothing unlocked for Mr. Walker yet. Oh, you know this would have told me that. <laughs> I'm stupid. Right, let's get back to Mother Base. Heading to Mother Base. We need a shower. So how are you, Dryan? Glad you could drop in. <laughs> well, so far they, they don't seem to notice when... Like, they're on a base with 20-some people and they all disappear except for two. Like, yeah, I'm gonna go out and have a beer. See you guys in a bit. Comes back. Where'd everybody go? Yeah, they're probably just pulling a prank. Ah, beast stung me. Oh, getting tired. Oh, prank. You know, I'm doing pretty good. Second day off out of four in a row. Playing a really badass video game. Hanging out with some friends on my left stream here. We got, uh, well, I have a dog right now, but we have hot pants. Play for fun. Oh, pretty good. Come on, dog, help me knock these guys over. Wash this blood off. You can't go to dinner looking like this. Thank you for getting our men out, boss. No problem. You get a raise. You too. Good to see you, boss. You don't get away, you whore. And you. Oops. Oh, well, you know, hold on. 
it works. <laughs> ah, that you bastard. Well, that was fun. <laughs> kind of expected there to be a cutscene. Uh, I don't want to do the R&D platform at night. The the shooting thing, target practice. <clears throat> Jeez. Side ops opened up. Okay, prisoner extraction. I could have sworn we did this. That one. Wandering Mother Base Source. Uh, gives us another. Oh, good point. I could smoke. It's a guard guy. This gives us another picture and another thing with, uh, what is it, cause or cause? Mine cleaning up. Tank unit destruction. We'll go do the wandering dude. Pause, okay. Yeah, let's go chill and get the... Let's go rescue him. Then we get a cutscene back here at the base. Whirly bird, please! Roger. This is Arriving shortly Rumble Hippo. Now I know his name. Whee! Oh, shit! I missed! Hold on. Hold on. on there we go. Oh, you do? Sorry. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't do that mission right now. This off some of my dude. No, <clears throat> oh, that sucks. He doesn't get a good ending, huh? Quick! Faster! Faster! They're saluting me! I don't want them to know I was here! <laughs> the enemy gets suspicious if you crash your vehicle. Oh, I wonder why. Funny, I didn't let Steve get that drunk before I sent him out to drive that thing. Alright, pup, let's go get this poor dude. Please select a landing zone. Heading to Central Africa. Yeah, let's just go do it. <laughs> yeah, go find Steve. I'm sitting in something wet. Such a pretty game. We we gonna stop anytime soon, Mr. Helicopter Guy? There we go. Be careful down there, boss. You got it, Pequod. Oh, hell, it's this place. Oh, nice. Thanks, dog. Glad I wasn't thirsty. 